my Philips LED light bulb. 10 and a half watts replaces a 60 watt bulb, but you notice on here it says last 18 and a half years. Well, I've had this bulb approximately one year, maybe just a little over a year, and it died, gone out completely. Now it's past the one year warranty. Philips is very good at saying that the um, it, they say it's going to last 18 years, but when we look at the warranty on here, it has a limited warranty. I don't know if you can read that or not, but it's one year based on three hours of average use per day, seven days per week. Well, I, I doubt that this has been used three hours a day. Maybe it has, maybe a little more, maybe a little less. There's a desk lamp on my office, so it got a fair bit of use, but um, certainly I don't think enough to use up the 20,000 hours that it's rated, and it just went out. So because this was an expensive bulb, it was about uh, 15 or $16, I'm going to open this sucker up and see what went wrong with it. Here's a little experiment, something that a lot of people probably didn't realize. Here are white LEDs. LEDs do not actually emit white light. A white LED is actually, the light that the LED emits is actually blue. Because a light emitting diode is a monochromatic light source. And how a white LED works is that the white LEDs are coated with a yellow phosphorus. When they're struck with blue light, they glow yellow. The yellow light mixes with the blue light, and what you see is white light. I can demonstrate this by taking this LED lamp that I've removed the cover from, and we'll just point it towards the blue LED. And you'll notice that the LEDs will start to glow yellow. See that? In the presence of the blue light, these will light yellow. When the yellow light that's emitted from the yellow phosphorus mixes with the blue light from the diode, you have white light. So here's the inside of the bulb after uh, I was testing it with my ohm meter. I found this one diode here that I just bridged over with some solder has gone open. Each of the little diodes, I put my meter across, across each one. They all appear to be wired in series, so one goes open or fails, the whole bulb goes out. So I've just um, soldered a little bridge across this one here, and let's see if this thing works. Well, here it is, my desk lamp fixture. Let's just see if it turns on. I guess that answers that question. There's the one that was shot. And uh, my light is once again working. So buyer beware. These things here don't necessarily last as long as uh, they'd like you to believe. And when they do go south, the uh, manufacturers just turn a blind eye and say, well, we give you a one-year warranty. Too bad, so sad. Give us another $15.